Hello friends, welcome to Deep World of Knowledge. Today we have taken the topic Prism and Pyramid. A prism is a 3D shape with two identical shapes facing each other. These identical shapes are called bases. The base can be a triangle, square, rectangle or any other polygon. As we know, polygon is a closed shape which is made up of straight lines. The other faces of prism are parallelogram or rectangular. Discussing about a pyramid, a pyramid is also a 3D shape. But the only difference is that it has one base which is a polygon and it has flat triangular sides that join at a common point, common vertex, which is known as apex. So as we have discussed, a prism is a three dimensional shape and it has identical bases. Over here there is one base, over here there is another base. It has identical bases. Over here the bases are triangle. Okay, both the bases are identical triangles and it has faces. It has flat faces. This is one face, this is another face and this is one more face. So it has flat faces and it has two identical bases. Whereas if we take a pyramid, a pyramid is a three dimensional shape with only one base. As you can see over here, the base is a square. So the base can be any polygon. This is a square. A square is a polygon. So over here, it has one base and all the edges, as you can see, all the edges are meeting at one vertex over here. Okay. So it has one base and all the edges, they meet at a single point over here. So this is a pyramid. This is a pyramid and this is a prism. Now there is one more difference between prism and pyramid. As you can see over here, this is a prism. Now you can see all the faces of a prism are rectangular. Over here there is one rectangle. You can see this is also a rectangular face. This is also a rectangular face. But when I take a pyramid, for pyramid you can see the faces are always triangular. This is a triangle, this is a triangle, this is a triangle, this is a triangle. So the faces are always triangular. To understand this, let us have a small activity. So to understand that, we will do a small activity. What I have done over here is, I have taken a triangular base over here the base is a triangle and another triangle as another base so identical triangles this is a prism now these threads represent the edges these are the edges so you can see that this is vertex number one vertex number two vertex number three vertex number four so these are the parallel edges. So it is a parallelogram. You can also say that this is a rectangle over here. So a prism has all rectangular faces. Over here there are three faces. All are rectangular. To see the difference between prism and pyramid and to understand that uh, the faces for a prism are rectangle but for a pyramid are triangle. What we will do? I will just cut the edges over here and we are reducing these top three vertex to only one what i will do is i'll just join the three edges so that they meet at a single point a single vertex instead of the previous three vertex so this is a pyramid now you can see this is a pyramid with a triangle as a base the base is a triangle and the edges are also triangular. You can see the edges over, the faces over here are triangular. It has triangular faces. So this is second difference between a prism and pyramid. 
a prism has a rectangular faces whereas a pyramid has triangular faces so you can see this is a triangular prism because the bases are triangles so this is a triangular prism and this is another prism let us see how many faces does it have it has 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 faces and 2 bases over here now if i see this base it has 7 sides 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so what do you call a polygon of 7 sides yes we call it as heptagon so this is a heptagonal prism So how do we name the prism or pyramids? The name of prism or pyramid is given according to their bases. For example, if the base is triangle for prism, then it will be triangular prism. If it is square bases, then it will be square prism. Similarly, for pyramid also, if the base is triangle, then it will be triangular pyramid. If the base is square, then it will be square pyramid and so on. As we know, the polygons can be regular. So what are regular polygons? Regular polygons are the polygons which are equiangular and the sides are also equal. Similarly, if a prism has a regular polygon as the base, then the prism will be a regular prism. Whereas if it has irregular polygon as the basis, then it will be irregular prism. Similarly, the pyramids can also be regular or irregular. Usually we see right prism only, but a prism can be a right prism or it can be an oblique prism. Now, what do we mean by right prism? As you can see in the diagram below, a right prism is a prism in which the joining edges and faces are perpendicular to the faces. You can see these edges and faces are perpendicular to the base. Whereas an oblique prism is a prism if the joining edges and faces are not perpendicular to the base. As we discussed that prism can be right prism or oblique prism. Similarly, the pyramid can also be a right pyramid or an oblique pyramid. As shown in the figure below, when the apex is directly above the center of the base, then it will be called a right pyramid. And when it is not directly above the base, the center of the base, then it will be oblique pyramid. Thanks for watching. Do subscribe the channel for more such informative videos. Thank you.